Hey guys, uh, Hybrid here. Um, you know, I know you guys haven't seen a lot of me. That's just because, as you may be able to tell, um, you know, college started back up. So, you know, I had to move in my dorm. Sorry about the poor lighting, by the way. It's just because of my dorm and how it is. But anyways, um, I've been making a lot of these Phase 3 movies, like how I would like to see them done kind of thing, like story ideas. Uh, I did one for Captain America. That one seemed to do well. So I'll do another one. So recently, see, is it around? Oh, I was all the way over there. I won't get it. Um, me and my room, my, my sweet mates, I'm in a sweet, we watched The Lion King. And it really got me thinking, I would like to see a Black Panther movie done like this. Uh, and by that, I mean, you know, the story of Simba could easily be tweaked a little bit and to, to fit with the T'Challa. Like, obviously, you'd have to have some other tweaks, you know, with Scar's char like character. Um, you know, it's like the antagonist, all that stuff. But overall, you have a very similar story arc, and it'd be great. It'd really fit the role of T'Challa, and I think it'd really capture, because probably the film's going to struggle with him and the responsibility of being king, because if they do it like in the comics, his father's going to get killed, and because his father is king and he was the prince, he has to be king. So all in all, that's just my quick idea there as like the basis of the plot, you know, just take some cues from Lion King. Like They can do it without being sued, because Marvel's owned by Disney. So that's all like fair game basically. And people can't say that if they're going to take something, you know, why not take it from Lion King? That's a great movie for a reason. The story is one of those reasons. It's just a great movie overall. I love it. It's one of my favorite movies of all time. I, I, I can continue talking about The Lion King and not Black Panther forever, but I'm talking about Black Panther. So, uh, you know, for the story... Black Panther's villains, like Rogue's Gallery, it's very unique and very far in between because of how um, separate Wakanda is from everyone else. Like usually when he is fighting other villains it's because he's with the Avengers. So with that being said, if they were to create a new villain, I'd be totally fine with that. I'd actually prefer them to create a new villain inspired by other villains because of the fact that, like kind of like what they did with Iron Man 2, uh, where they, com they combined Whiplash with Crimson Dynamo. Something like that to make a new character just because of the fact that T'Challa doesn't really have that many personal villains. And the story of T'Challa, the story of the Black Panther is a very personal story. And I think it needs to be presented as such. Uh, you know, just like how Lion King is a very personal story. You know, Scar was the villain. Scar was Simba's uncle. So, all in all, um, yeah, I think the film should spend, I'd say, 30 minutes at least on the relationship between T'Chaka and T'Challa. T'Chaka's uh, T'Challa's father, by the way. And you're just like in Lion King, build the relationship of father and son. And I, if Lion King didn't already do it already, I'd be like, give him the whole circle of life talk and all that stuff. Because like I said before, Lion King's such a good movie and it could easily be translated to a Black Panther movie um, with a few tweaks. But all in all, you know, that's really what I have to give um, for ideas. I'd love to hear your guys' ideas though. I know this video is kind of short. You guys may have been expecting like a 10 minute, like I'm gonna write the plot out for them kind of movie, but you know, I don't have to do that because there's there's something already out there that could be perfect inspiration, like The Lion King. So comment below what your guys' thoughts. Uh, for a Black Panther movie, would you like to see The Lion King? Would you like to not see Lion King? And also before I even um, end the video, I meant to also say, uh, for Black Panther, I'd like them to make him peak human. Um, and that could be really interesting, just like Captain America. Maybe a little bit faster um, in senses and all that stuff. Also, I would love them to exploit that. Like, go into the senses. Go into the mythology of Wakanda, the panther goddess, stuff like that. Because I don't want him, I don't want him to be just a more stealthier Captain America, obviously. And also go into the vibranium. Like, it'd be really cool if they stayed to the comics and they go into the fact that Vibranium essentially is from outer space. Um, that'd be pretty cool. There's actually a planet. Um, wow, my lighting is really bad. Let's see. Does this work? Nope. Okay, there's actually a planet in the Marvel Comics made entirely of um, Vibranium. Or not entirely, but they have like... Their planet has like a Vibranium-like core, I believe. But anyways, I'm going off to a tangent. So, comment below your guys' thoughts. Uh, Black Panther movie, what would you guys like to see? And, uh, yeah, actually, I would like to see 
for love interest, uh, maybe someone named Aurora as a nod to Storm, but not Storm, obviously. So, without further ado, this is Hybrid, and I'll see you guys later.